Hi, so I just want to do a quick comparison of the SFBT3, which is the special full action body type 3, this one here, and the Art S book artist model from Slideshow Collectibles, which is here. Here. <laughs> I'm sorry. You can guess that, yep, I am not the biggest fan of that particular figure. I did pose him nicely at first, but I'm just not a fan of that model. You know, I want an artist reference figure which is awesome and cool and looks good on the shelf and also does its job. And he doesn't. And that's why I'm on a quest to find the best artist reference model possible. Now, I've already done an unboxing of the ultimate fabulous SFBT3 here. Wow. And I'm just finished videoing a group collection of poses done with this model as well. But I thought I'd show you side by side with the RS book model. Now, I expected Slideshow Collectible to be a really, really good reference model, but it's not. And side by side, they're the same height, which actually should make them really good to work together. But it's funny, now that I actually see them side by side, I remember how bad he is at posing, how God awful the stand is, it's really bad. The stand is horrendous. You know, he doesn't, he doesn't stand on the stand. It's ironic calling it a stand. It's like some horrendous medical torture device from centuries gone by. But the one thing I do notice is how tiny and baby-like his feet are. They're not proportional to the rest of him. I never noticed this really before, because I never, I don't know, maybe I just never drew the feet from this, or maybe I used it from particular angles. I know I. the main illustration that I used it on was kind of like that angle a lot. You know, I only really use these when it comes down to doing specific angles that are hard to work out in your mind, but I never noticed how baby-like his feet are. You look at the size of his hands, then look at his feet. I put them next to each other. Yeah, if your feet are that size in comparison to your hands, you have tiny feet. Um, so yeah, she has over 80 points of articulation. He has, let's count them, one, two, twenty-four points of articulation compared to over 80. And that base is horrendous. And all that from a company who do some amazing work. Slideshow collectibles are brilliant and they do some amazing work, but this artist reference model is not, um, is not to be considered up to their usual standards. So, yeah. Sadly to say, that is a piece of rubbish. That, the SFBT3 is absolutely awesome. So far on my quest to find the ultimate ice reference figure, if you are looking for it, this is it. Tune in for more videos. I shall speak to you soon. Pick me, pick me. I think it's hers. Well, thanks for watching. Be sure to comment, like, and even subscribe to my channel, Lawrence Can Draw. And if you really did like what you saw here, you can see more of it on my website, lawrenceman.co.uk. I'll see you next time.